Happy Thursday morning, Geminis. <clears throat> How are my Geminis doing this morning? I'm getting ready to start your reading here right away, Gemini. Please like and subscribe if you haven't done so. And hit the bell so you know when the next uh, video is coming out for you. And let's get started. Gemini, I do offer also a $20 read. If interested, you can click on the description below the video. And let's see what Spirit has for you today. All right, I'm definitely getting the feeling that somebody just moved away from something that was crushing your heart, okay, and just making you feel awful, and you felt very judged by this situation, and you moved away from it, all right, kudos to you. Spirit is saying you made the right decision, and that things are going to start to become much better for you, okay, things are going to start to flourish, because there was a blockage from this negativity that this situation was creating in your spirit okay so things are going to start flowing for you now so keep your eyes open and above all they're saying use your intuition on every decision you make and anything that or anyone that's coming into your circle okay make sure you're paying attention to any uh bad energy or red flags okay um this is an awesome layout guys okay Something really good is coming in for you that's going to have you celebrating like there's no tomorrow, okay? Whatever this is, and I feel like it has something to do with monies, okay? Because I'm seeing you here um, looking wealthy, feeling like everything's, you know, just feeling like you're on top of the world and you have everything you could ever ask for, want for, and mentally you're feeling just a very serene calmness. No stress, no anxiety, just a beautiful type of happy, uh, joyous type of emotions kind of thing. So that's the temperance card, balance, uh, balancing out, okay? And celebration and happiness. This whole layout, guys, is celebration and more celebration, um, more abundance and happiness, okay? It doesn't get any better than this, Gemini. This is awesome. All right, we're moving on to someone who is dealing with something toxic. Um, there's things going on in your life right now that are um, not in your control, okay? Um, you're waiting on some information that is going to be some type of good news, something you're going to want to hear, and something that might even rectify the situation because whatever this is, um, it's either making you feel trapped or it's something extremely toxic in your life that's affecting you to the point where you're anxious, you're not sleeping at night, and you, you might even, you know, be um, just just upset beyond words, I'm going to say, okay? Um, this is like two feminines here that are just not... I don't know if this is mother daughter or sisters or who whoever I don't know what you are to each other but you're just continuously rubbing each other the wrong way you're not getting along you could be like besties or something all right something's getting in the way of your relationship I see it coming to an end and I see this new start for the two of you a new beginning and maybe at this point that's what's best okay All right, Spirit said, you know, focus on yourselves right now. Focus on you, okay? And also they want you to know that they see you as the star. This is how they view you. More importantly, you should see yourself as the star, all right? Focus on you. Love and nurture yourself and do not let anybody talk down to you or disrespect you in any manner, okay? Just know you who you are and, you know, make decisions on your finances right now, Um in a way where you're holding on to them possessively, okay? Don't overspend right now. Be careful with your money. Um, this is not the time to buy something big or go out and buy a car or, you know, anything like that. So I'm, I'm picking up on a masculine who feels like somebody's just tried to get over on you. 
Um, you weren't expecting this. It's making you feel some kind of way. You're you're going through a lot of inner conflict over this. This is really eating you up alive. Um, whatever this situation was, it, it's going to be okay. Spirit is seeing you. Uh, feeling your your happiness is going to come back in other words okay um, you're just going to feel stuck for a little while and your happiness is going to return and it looks it looks like a lot of happiness okay like an abundance of happiness All right, so I, I have this couple here. I have the Empress and the King of Wands. Um, there's a lot going on in your lives right now that's making you feel um, like you can't move forward. Um, this is a marriage. And whatever is going on between you or something going on in your lives right now that is burdening you and making you feel um, guarded, okay, Almost like you have to protect yourselves from something. All right. I'm seeing that you're going to get clarity on this. You're going to figure this out. Everything's going to be okay. And this might have something to do with money. I'm seeing a lot of money coming into you and I'm seeing a lot of celebration. So it looks like whatever this is, is going to work its way out. And um, you're going to be very content with the results. Okay. Um, someone just went through this tower moment, but is freeing themselves from it and walking away from it, just done with it. Okay. Um, you're understanding with this tower moment. And, and again, guys, if you don't know the tower moment is an event or a string of events that has you feeling like your whole world is coming down around you, or it could just be some really chaotic stuff around you right now. Okay. You're understanding how to move away from this and not let it devour you, okay? You are very strong and you're manifesting your way out of that, all right? And I see you looking out into the world, you know, kind of like what's next. And so that's really good, all right? You're figuring out, Gemini, how to not get stuck in these situations emotionally and just disconnect from things and move on. Okay, that's important because when you master that, you're not going to be walking around on the daily, you know, letting everything affect you and just feeling horrible inside. You're going to be happy. All right. So I'm seeing some kind of movement here with this Knight of Wands. Um, Yeah, I feel like you went, you, you chose this third party and it was a big mistake. You're realizing what a mistake you made now and you're feeling really sad. Um, you can't, yeah, you can't see your way out of this. You, you, you're regretting it. You're regretting it a lot. Okay. Um, get out of the, get out of this state of, uh, regret and get into the state of gratefulness. Okay. Okay. You're looking at what you lost, okay, the three cups on the ground, and you're not noticing the two full ones behind you. You're not noticing what you still have, all right? So, to my Knight of Wands, be grateful for what you have, okay? I don't know what you want to do with this new person you have, you know, whether it works or it's not working for you. That's your decision, but I see you have a cycle coming to you here, or it's been here, but for whatever reason, it's being blocked, okay? Okay? So you have a whole slew of good things coming to you from this cycle um, for your betterment. And you need to start noticing the positive side of that. Whatever's coming into you from now on, notice it. Be grateful for it. Remind yourself you're grateful. And this is going to raise your vibration. Okay? And bring in a lot of happiness. All right? Wow, guys. So I'm seeing this victory here. I'm seeing these, uh, this King of Cups and this Knight of Cups. This is a lot of love. Okay. So it looks like there's two masculines who have been, you know, courting this, this feminine here, or at least, you know, crushing on her, trying to win her over, trying to interest her. Um, 
<laughs> the funny part of this is I don't know which one of you is going to win this feminine over, but I do see one of you coming in to give or both of you and a victory being had. So one of you is going to get your wish here, not both of you. And I don't know. Let's go a little further. There's the lover's card. Okay. And, you know, somebody is coming in quickly. All right. Somebody's not messing around. So I feel like, um, and, and this person is, even though you're coming in quickly, you're also going to have the knowledge that this feminine, she, she, in other words, you can't be obvious that you're coming in quickly. You can't be too much. You have to get there first, but don't be too much. You know what I'm saying? Lay back, um, be mellow, uh, and be sweet. And she is going to, she's ready for this. Okay. She's been doing some healing and a lot of thinking, and this is something she wants. But you have to come in the right way. All right. So things are going to work out for you. I'm so excited. I don't know which one of you is going to, um, you know, have get this feminine. But, you know, good luck to the two of you. And Gemini, you have a fabulous Thursday.